Hi, this is Sylvia and today I'm gonna show you how you can collaborate with another person in your magic plan. So once you start using the app, you are on a free version, of course. What you see here is my magic plan cloud. So if you want to add another person to your workspace, so to collaborate with you, you need to go to cloud.magicplan.app and you have to tap on upgrade. You will select the uh, plan that you prefer. Let's imagine that we purchase two seats for a sketch plan so that we're able to work with another person. So here you have quantity, let's do two, we can update it. And once we purchase the two seats, you will see here that you have one out of two seats that is used because that is for you. So to invite another person, we need to go here in members and we can just invite someone else. This other person has to download the app to sign up for free and to accept the link that will be sent through this page. OK, it will be sent automatically. So don't worry about that. Once the other person accepts your invite, then you will be in, let's say, two or more people in the same workspace. So imagine the workspace as your virtual office, so to say. So if you have a project or more projects, only the workspace owner will be able to see them all and the other members of your workspace will be able to see their project. So it depends on what role you have, right? But you can always assign a project to the other person. So you just enter your project. Here we go. And here on the top, you have the option to edit the project as you need. So once the other person is part of your workspace, you just select the other email from here and you can just assign the project to this other person. So it will be possible to download that project on the app, on the mobile device, and your colleague is able to keep working on that project. You could also discuss important topics directly on your project using the commenting feature that you see here on the bottom, and you can have a live discussion with your colleague directly there. But if you need more structure in your magic plan and the workspace is not enough because you have a lot of people working in your company, then you can also create teams. So you can divide people according to what they do, perhaps, or you could also divide your company, your co-workers, depending on the town where they are located, depending on how big is your company, of course. And if you create teams, you could also invite guests to your teams. So it could be, for example, an external contractor. So if this person uses Magic Plan and has an independent account with a paid subscription, you can invite this person, even if he or she is not part of your workspace, but can be part of one of your teams. I hope that this video was useful and that you learned something new. If you have any questions, you can always contact us at support at magicplan.f and I'll see you in our next video.